Hey, this is Max. Welcome back to another CSR2 video. So I have gotten the update um, and on this particular account at least, I am now able to show you what the newest thing that was added to CSR2 is, and that is the Legends uh, part of CSR2, which is basically an event, almost like a Tempest 4 kind of thing, but unique to um, the way it's set up in that it's almost combining what was CSR Classics with CSR2. So what is this whole thing about? Well, it's a new series of races and uh, events to get you ultimately to a McLaren F1 five-star purple car. You're first asked to use simply any old tier two car to uh, earn Izzy's respect. This should be easy because the tier two car that I have selected, the Boxster, is quite fast. And I don't think this is supposed to be a tough challenge at this point in the process. So let's take a look and see what's going on here. Um, we should be able to easily see that the Boxster would beat uh, whatever car Izzy may have in mind. Let's take a look. So with this particular uh, version of Knox, what happens is in the middle of the race, the screen gets kind of blurry. Just like, see, see that where the boxer is looking blurry? That's a graphical uh, thing that's happening on some Androids. Uh, I'm experiencing that since I updated this Knox, but it is what it is. It doesn't do that on my Google Pixel phones, which is nice, but it does do it on this uh, particular computer uh, emulator. But it's something I can still live with. I just don't stare at it when it's racing, that's all. Okay, easy peasy right there. Let's see what it does now. It's probably going to take us back to garage because there was no immediate button to go to next race. So once I click on this part, it should bring us back to the garage. At least I expected to do that. Loading time with this new update seems to be rather long. I'm not sure why, but that is what's going on with the revised loading. It could just be because it's a beta test. Uh, it's causing some issues with my computer emulator, but still, this is a very long loading period for what it should be. Come on, load. Any day now. Okay. All right, so yeah, we're back in the garage. Uh, special event. We'll skip that for now. So that's there's your Legends uh, tab right there. It's still locked, meaning you haven't finished the first four races. It probably won't let me into that garage there. When I click on it, it basically says, off you go. Go unlock the Legends garage. Back to Izzy's respect races. There's only four. Shouldn't be hard at all. Okay. Jess, what's going on? Oh, sister, huh? Interesting. Must be a small town. Everybody's everybody else's relative. Oh, my God, the loading time. I'm growing a beer just looking at that. Okay, here we go. Wow, that is one beat up car I am racing. Fortunately, it's also very slow, so this will be another easy win. Yay, done, round two. Two more to go, but back to the garage first because we want to make sure everything is nice and slow so you don't blow through it in five minutes. 50 gold. I'm sure they're going to have something that'll use up that 50 gold coming up. So let's see where they're going to start asking for that gold. All right. Uh, I, I wish I could leave town, Jesse. Honestly, I do, but I can't because you don't let me. I would leave town in a heartbeat. Go race somewhere else. Sure. Back to loading. I hope this is not the new loading time when the actual update drops. I mean, that is just horrendously slow. But then again, 
with all this new data being uploaded as I'm playing this, I'm sure that has some, hopefully, some basis for the delay. But nonetheless, I don't like looking at the loading screen for too long. Yes, any day now. Just load the race so I can move forward. Oh, here we go. Round three against the bot 302. Goodbye. That was very easy. Well, at least her respect's easy to earn. Okay, 1800 of the new currency. Okay, I'm sure we're going to end up knowing how quickly we're going to spend that. I suspect it's going to be a lot quicker than you think. Let's see how far 1800 stars will get us later, but let's finish race number four so we can get there. Okay, where are we at here? Right, not yet, not yet. Let me finish that first. Okay, here we go. Race number four. So this will get you the Ferrari 250 GTO, which is the first of the restoration projects. I'm sure there's going to be a lot more following that. This is, again, a new update with a bunch of stuff that I'm sure their intent is not for you to finish in two days. I'm sure somebody's going to finish them in two days. But, you know, just like Tempest 3, if you rush through it, then you have nothing more to do. So why rush? Um, the F1's not going anywhere. This is a story mode kind of event, not timed. So I don't see this being super difficult to deal with. Although, that being said, I, I did see something that says it's coming in four days. So we'll see if there's something actually timed that's going to kick in and affect how this plays out. Okay, so I just finished that part. I have now earned the Rusty 250 GTO. And I probably opened up that garage now. So let's see where we're going with this. Great driving, friend. The promise is promise. So how about we get that for her back to the studio? Yay! Now I should be able to access the studio. Let's see what it looks like. Come on, studio. Wow. Come on, load screen. Let's go. If this is a new norm, there's going to be a lot of complaining from a lot of people. Okay, so now it's unlocked. You tap it. You access the studio. Let's see what they give us for the studio. Should be nice. Not bad. So this is where all that work was being done. Hmm. Decent. I wouldn't mind a uh, garage like that. Okay. So let's get the 250 GTO in here. And there it is. Barn find rusty GTO. Now we're gonna know how much it costs to restore. Let's take a look how far 1800 gets us. I can guarantee you it's not gonna get you far. The question is how little does it get me? It's re the real question here. There's that F1. Okay, from unloved to pristine, just like CSR Classic. So basically, people have asked for classic cars, and um, this is kind of a combination of CSR Classics and uh, introducing that component into CSR 2. Oh, so it's not only going to cost you money, it's going to cost you time. So there you go. This is not going to be a quick process. A thousand only got me some restored rims. Wonderful. So now what? Now you have a new event for this car, which I can now try to race. Collect components and we'll restore your Ferrari. Okay. Let's see what it looks like. All right. 1,000, 2,000, 3,000, 4,000, 5,000, 6,000, 7,000, 8, 9, 10, uh-oh, I lost count there. What was that 12,250? 
All right, maybe I might have miscounted, but anyway, somewhere around 10 to 12,000 of these uh, star coins, legends currency is what you're going to get out of this. So let me race one and see what happens. Okay, so we're going to get enough points to restore the rusty paint job. Sounds like a plan. Let's do it. Not the best launch in the world. Mm, slowly but surely. Wow, this thing's a tire spinner. Spinning tires through second gear. It's picking up some speed, though. What do we got? 14.1 against 14.5. And that Mustang's a T1, it looks like. So, 1,000 points. Okay. Again, couldn't continue. So this, none of these events so far for the Legends have a next button. So this is much like Tempest. After one race, you're done. You, oh, back to the shop. Uh-oh. Hmm. All right, so we're back to the shop. The paint. Okay, so I, I hope this is not going to be like this for every car where you're forced to restore a particular thing in water, but I, this may be the case. 1800, so there goes my entire balance. Oh, here you go. I knew they were going to want you to spend some gold somewhere. Instantly, you can get it down for 30, or you can wait 29 minutes. I will wait the 29 minutes. I'm in no hurry to rush through this thing. But you kind of get an idea what this is about. This is going to be restoring old crappy cars into a pristine car. And hey, where did that one go? It was 30 minutes ago. Anyway, I think eventually through the events with these restored cars, you will ultimately have the chance to win the McLaren F1, which is really the end game here for this event. Um, I don't know if there's going to be a time limitation. There may be. We'll see. But Certainly, looking at the time it would take to restore each part, I doubt it's going to be very quick. This is a story mode type event, so probably plenty of time for you to finish. Nothing you have to rush through. So that is a quick introduction of the new CS2 Legends portion of the game, the new update. Everybody will begin this soon. Um, I noticed there are now 20 new cars listed under the dealership. Let's go take a look at that real quick. I'm sure most of them are the Legend cars. Yep, 16, 16 Legend cars. Let's see what, what it shows. Oh, there's your Celine S1. Before. After. Before. It's going to need some work. Now, the question is, how come I can't see the other cars? What's going on here? Okay. There should be a back option here somewhere. I can't get out. I'm stuck. What's going on here? Come on. Nothing? Oh, there it is. Phew. All right. So that just that was probably just uploading the info because the first time I accessed it. Well, that was a little scary. Okay, so here you go. That's the F1, McLaren F1. And that is five purple stars. Notice that has purple stars. But everything else in the Legend Garage, Bot 302, DB5, et cetera, et cetera. Notice they have no stars. So you're using a bunch of cars that ultimately, even fully restored with fusions, everything else is still no stars. To try to win a car that will have stars. So this is probably not going to be an easy event in the long run. It's going to take some time to put together. We'll see. I mean, time, investment. I guess I can't buy more of these to um, strip for stage sixes either. Well, at least we'll find out about that too. Because if it costs money that could be why this car does not come with stars if they let us buy multiples of this that'll be good i can at least strip it for uh, fusions and stage sixes because some of these brands like the ac cobra may be unique fusions 
Because it's, yep, that's a new brand. Pontiac, new brand. Honda's not, but some of these are definitely new brands. Oh, that's a car I do want, though. Honda NSX. Ah, this one's still covered. Interesting. That's probably an event car that's still coming up. That's why it's still covered. Kuntak. This one's not covered, but you got to beat restoring faith to unlock. Okay, so there, there's going to be a bunch of things that it looks like you're going to have to do to get to the Kuntak and then the GT40 and then ultimately the McLaren F1. I'm sure there's going to be quite a bit of investment involved here, time, money, and other things. Okay, so that is a quick review of the new Legends. Let me know what you think. Do you look forward to this or do you not? As always, thank you for watching my videos and I'll catch you next time.